Uh, my name is John Uffold and I'm a member of a small family farming partnership in Shropshire and we've purchased seeds from Cotswold Seeds for a lot of years now. I'm Chris Mile, uh, we've, second time I've been here, um, not since Farm Ed but before. Um, we, our connection is we have been buying seeds from Cotswold Seeds for, well we started our herbal lay last this year and we've done a few other things in the past. Okay, I'm Stephen Fletcher. Um, we've come from a village called Berkswell between Coventry and Birmingham. Um, we, uh, uh, our main enterprise is milking sheep and making cheese. I thought it was stimulating, uh, provo mind provoking really. Uh, the philosophy behind it is completely different. And it is a question of philosophy of where farming is going, where it needs to go, and the problems facing farming at the present time, especially as we're coming out of Europe and facing perhaps cheap imports from abroad, sustainability, climate change, biodiversity, all of the in things, but how do you translate that on the ground? And I think that's what the visit today has really been about. How do you try to get those philosophical beliefs onto the ground so they are practically deliverable because a lot of these policies are fine words and hot air but unless you can practically implement what is being suggested they will have no value at all going forward. Um, we've been purchasing Cotswold seeds on and off for quite some time but um, recently we've uh, used one of their herbal lays. I think farm has been really good it's been quite an inspirational walk around Ian is very articulate and puts the, the message over very well and uh, I think we'll take, certainly take home some good ideas. Um, the ideas I think we'll take home are certainly um, extensive use of herbal lays and also we've an interest in growing heritage wheat so that might be something that we can, we can talk about and just the general management of the soil using shallow plough and whatnot it's the sort of thing that we're, you know, we're looking at quite seriously. And, and the place yeah obviously all the trial plots I'm always interested in the sheep side of things um, and seeing it being done at source uh, helps inspire you <laughs> and remind you what you're doing wrong and, and <laughs> hopefully what you're doing right. But yeah, really interesting. I have the whole ethos of the place. Uh, the buildings are wonderful, really, really nice. You know, it's a space I could see really working um, and spreading this word that we're all trying to get involved in. Yeah, and uh, the way forward, as it is. <laughs>